multiple cars. It's trying to move everything out the driveway. If you got one car parked in front of another one, you gotta move them out the way. So, yeah, let's do that. Let's move this out the way. Man, this thing look good at night. Let's cut that off. Bam. 107.5 WGCI. take a cruise tonight guys you know late night vibes it's a lot of things going on right now i'm doing a lot of things and i like to do this sometimes just to reflect on life uh, the goods the bads uh the future you know any car lovers you kind of do the same thing you know i know you guys can relate to that if you're a car lover you know sometimes you just enjoy the car so sometimes you just hop in the car and you just want to enjoy the car. Not not also, not always just to think about things, but this is my my relaxation, you know. My peace of mind sometimes, you know. Just to drive. That's why I take cruises and stuff sometimes late at night. Like right now, it's what? One, one o'clock in the morning. You know, everybody else is sleeping. I'm out taking the car out going for a drive but my life is a very busy and it's like non-stop doing different things and it seems like I never really have time to myself and only time I do have to myself is when everyone else is asleep you know and that tends to be at times like this at one o'clock two o'clock in the morning 12 o'clock you know when everybody else is kind of fast asleep I can only so the time I really have time to myself to think about things and reflect on different things, the goods, the bads, the ugly. And um, as you find, a lot of successful people do that. They, they, they take some time in their day to reflect and think. Um, and you, you, you in life have to. You have to reflect and you have to think because if you think about, about the decisions you made, good and bad, it helps you make the next decision. Everybody is not a late night cruiser and say, I'm gonna go take a cruise late at night, you know, and to clear my mind. Some people may, being on the toilet may be their time to reflect on life and reflect on different things in their journey. Uh, some may be laying in the bed. Wherever you can find your time to think and really reflect on things, do it, you know. But make sure you fit that time in, no matter what. Make sure you fit that time in. Reflect. You know, sometimes it depends on how I'm feeling. It's been a long week, long day. I may take a long cruise. Um, sometimes I don't even take that long of a cruise. Just a simple cruise. Just to kind of clear my head a little bit. No matter what you do for other people, you know, it's always important to take care of other people and do for your people if you're in position to be able to do for your people, do for them. But uh, always find some time for yourself, you know. That's why I buy cars the way I do, is because this is me, you know. I love cars, so no matter what else I do for everyone else, this is for me. My cars is for me, so times like this is when I spend these times with my cars. Just me and my cars. I look at my cars as my babies. I'm not the best father <laughs> when it comes to taking care of my cars. Sometimes I kind of neglect them sometimes, but I do drive them. I just, you know, got to get a little better to take care of them. But I'm not the bad. I'm not the worst. Now, let's not get it messed up now. I don't abuse them. But, I, you know, because I just be so busy. If I had more time, I would definitely, like, really, really take care of them. But I'd be so busy and doing so many things I, I really don't be having time to enjoy them and, and not just driving and enjoying them but also like getting to detail them and different little aspects about them working on them like I want to I don't be having the time that I love and enjoy that you know that's like being one with the car you know so it's not just all the ways about driving with me um, I know I don't do this a lot on the channel I'm not really big on stuff like this for the channel but 
I feel like it was needed. You know? It kind of mixes in with the love for cars and also some real life stuff, you know? Uh, people need, some people need this out there, you know? So this is what I'm trying to do. I want my channel to be not only about car content, but also motivational. You know, I'm always pushing and preaching motivational purpose. I want other people, not just other people, but young youth of Chicago specifically to realize that someone can come from where they come from and be able to do these things. To me, these are average things to me now. You know, I one once upon a time they weren't. You know, um, so sometimes I even forget. You know, and, and, and like, wow, you're here because I'm always thinking about the next thing. So, me being in the infinity right now, uh, and not just any type of infinity. This is Infinity FX45. You know, and, and not just having a Benz, but you know, but a special type of Benz, the S550. You know, and then I having a car that I can say is a work car, a Chrysler 200, a brand new car at that, you know, a more modern car. It's, it's, it's less than, what, five years old, you know what I'm saying? And uh, able to abuse it, you know, and run the miles on it and treat it like a work car, you know, at the age of 23, you know. And to come from where I come from, that's not normal, you know, it's not basic, but... I get used to those things because my goals become so much higher. Every time I hit a goal, I, I go set another goal. And sometimes you have to reflect and you have to pat yourself on the back sometimes and realize and, and understand the goal that you accomplished. Wow. That is a lot. I've done a lot, you know, but don't get caught into it. And see, that's where people get it misconstrued and, and they think, okay, Oh, yeah, I'm better than everybody else because I did this, I did that. No, that's not what I'm saying. But realize you're not average. And don't let anybody trick you into thinking you average, okay? Now, remember that, though. You know, when somebody tried to belittle you, be like, oh, hold up now, slow down now. Because I have done this, and I have done this, and I have done this. You know what I'm saying? If they try to, you know what I'm saying, talk to us, they, they, they stuff to you, talk your stuff, you know. But other than that, remain humble. You know what I'm saying? Being humble is not always about not speaking what you what you've done or what you've accomplished. Being humble is holding those accomplishments to your head and remembering your accomplishments and keep going as if you haven't accomplished anything. Yeah, guys, I'm not gonna make this video that long. I'm gonna just enjoy this cruising, but I just want to take you guys somewhat on this ride with me because you know I felt like this was needed. Said, yeah, find that time for yourself. Just find that time for yourself, guys. And uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Make sure you comment. And, uh, t and tell me in the comments the different things you do for yourself, you know, to take your time and your mind away from things. Let me know. You know, maybe it could be some things, some type of meditation that could help me, you know. So I definitely want to hear everybody and hear what everyone has to say. So let me know, guys, and uh, I'll see you guys next time.